sparklers welcome back to my channel my name is Jessica sparkles and happy mask Monday to you so I am doing this little mask right here this is the live green lavender and chamomile face mask hydrates nourishes and clarifies and I got this from miss Kim from Kimmy's boxes so uh, this is a little mask that we're doing and it feels really good on my face because it's really hot and the mask is cold so loving that so I bet y'all been wondering where I have been. So um, a lot of things have been going on. So I really just haven't been doing any videos like at all. I did a couple of shorts. Um, You might have seen those shorts from last week. We had one heck of a thunderstorm come through. So that was crazy and wild. And uh, yeah, so we've been, we've had some thunderstorms and stuff, but I've also been on puppy watch. Um, you guys know that my little Mocha uh, was expect was expecting puppies. We have puppies. Uh, she had her puppies Thursday, so they're four years old today, and they are in here with me down there in the crate. Mama's in there doing well. Um, if I can, at the end of this video, sorry, my bangs are just kind of everywhere at the moment. But um, if I can, at the end of this video, I'll do a little video of the puppies. So you might hear some little whimpers and stuff and um, you'll hear my air conditioner being on because it's hot. <laughs> um, it's like, it was 104 or something stupid yesterday. It's supposed to be 101 or something like that today. So it's just, it's nasty and it's hot. So got the air going, it's nice and cool. So let's talk about my little bambinos down here. So uh, Miss Mocha had all together nine puppies. She had seven boys and two girls <laughs> two girls out of all that um unfortunately one of the little boys was born stillborn and then one of our little boys um was born with a little cleft but he was very very tiny when he was born and he was very very weak and he he didn't make it so we have seven puppies so um we've got five boys and two girls right now so we are keeping the firstborn um he's a little brown pup and my aunt Rhonda named him his name is jedi and he is fat and roly poly and very vocal <laughs> um all of them are just precious they're so cute so so cute and so so tiny and mocha is doing really well and she is being an extremely good little mama so, um, I'm very proud of my little mocha mood. My masks, I don't know if it's because it's hot in this room where I'm keeping them, but the last couple I put on haven't felt real wet or real juicy, or maybe that's just the mask. So, they're like having a hard time sticking, and I misplaced my little um, thingy that goes on your face that holds the mask on, so we're just going to have to make do. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't have any makeup on because it is that time of the year where... It will melt off my face so um i've been having to take my aunt Rhonda to some doctor's appointments in oklahoma city and that is a little over an hour away from me plus the 30 minutes it takes for me to get to where aunt Rhonda lives so i've been pretty busy and uh she last friday she had no not friday thursday was it thursday no two weeks ago two uh almost three one yeah two Fridays ago she had a defibrillator put in for her heart so uh, but she's doing well that's healing up nicely I had to take her to her post-op appointment um, last Thursday up in the city to check it and it's all doing good and um, little Mocha waited until I got home that evening Thursday night uh, the 9th to have her puppy so that was exciting I was up a really long time um, altogether I was up 23 and a half hours with uh, well because I got up early to go and stuff and make sure that I was on time to take my aunt to her appointment but then after I had got home me and my husband was eating and Mocha wanted some of our food we always share our food with her and she ate some but then she threw it up and I was like I bet she's gonna have puppies soon I almost guarantee she's gonna have puppies by the end of this week me and puppy was talking and um, we got done eating. I, I cleaned up where she threw up at. And she was laying in the living room. She was over on my curtains. Because my curtains kind of drag the, drag the carpet. 
and she was laying over there on the on that curtain and I looked over at her and it looked like she was going mm, like that and I was like is she pushing I think she's having some contractions and she's pushing and I went over and looked and there was two little footsies hanging out and I was like oh oh it's puppy time so um I was like no I don't want you to have them in the living room but she followed me in here in the computer room where I had her set up to have babies and she went right to her little area and within a few seconds we had Jedi that is our little puppy that we're keeping his name is Jedi um he is all brown and he's got a little black mask that's forming he looks like he's got these cute little eyebrows and he's got a little white spot right on the back of his neck he's very very cute if you guys follow me on Facebook um, or if you're friends with me on Facebook I've got tons of pictures of them so uh, you'll have seen all of the puppies uh, but they are absolutely precious and they're just so little they're so little and they're so cute so I am a proud grandma um, but yeah, so Jedi was first born and then she had them really fast actually. And at first I only thought she was going to have six because she popped out six of them fairly quickly. And she laid down and she went to sleep and she was calm and I wasn't seeing any more contractions and she wasn't pushing anymore. So I said, okay, we've got six puppies. Cool. And I was staying in here with her just to watch her and I was looking up, I was on my computer and I googled because I wanted to be sure. I was like, how do I know that my dog's not in labor anymore? And as I was pulling this article up and I was looking through, I heard Mocha make a noise and I turned around, looked at her and she went, eh, and then out popped puppy number seven. <laughs> I was like, wow, okay. So puppy number seven. And then a few minutes later, here comes number eight. Number eight was sadly stillborn. Um, poor little guy, poor little guy. And then a few minutes after that, number nine was born. And then after that, she laid down and that was that. But I did stay in here with her all night long to make sure she was okay. And she was, and all the puppies were feeding and eating except for our little cleft puppy that was born. But like I said, he was born extremely small, uh, even smaller than what a runt would be born. He was real teeny, teeny, tiny. And he was, he was born feeling a little cold. And he made it until, oh, Saturday morning. I got up to come in here. Um, Friday night, I took him in the bedroom with me because his little body was really cold. So I took him in the bedroom with me and I laid him on the heating pad. I put the heating pad on low and I have like a heating pad that's got like fur on it, like a furry blanket. So I put it on low and he and I laid him on there and just tried to get him warm but his little body wouldn't warm up. So I brought him back in here. I let him stay in there for a while just so he felt some warmth for a couple of hours. I brought him back in here to Mocha and Mocha knew something was wrong because she kept um, kind of pushing him away from the other puppies. Bless his little heart. And I told my husband, I said, I don't think this little guy's going to make it. I just don't I don't feel like he's gonna make it um, so Saturday morning when I got up to come in and check on them he had passed so I was um, I'm so heartbroken over the two that didn't make it but mama's doing good uh, all the other puppies are doing good they're already really really big and roly-poly and just the cutest little things you ever did see so if you uh, my Facebook link is down below if you would like to go check out my Facebook. Everything is public on there, so um, you don't have to friend request me if you don't want to to see the pictures of the puppies or anything that I post um, because it's, it's all public. I don't have a private. Um, this mask, I'm just going to do this, so bear with me. I'm just going <laughs> to... You can hear them in there. They're so cute and tiny. Uh, but yeah, so that has been what I've been doing. Um, Aunt Rhonda does have a biopsy on her thyroid in a couple of weeks to make sure that it's not cancerous. So fingers crossed that her uh, thyroid is not cancerous because then they'll have to go in and remove it if it is. Um, so been doing a lot of running and a lot of going here and there and everywhere and what have you. So I did want to show, I haven't showed my ear fleek in like a long time. I still get it. I just forget to show it so this is June's ear fleek and if you don't are not uh, familiar with ear fleek it's an earring subscription it's like $3.95 a month and you get a little pair of earrings they do this like little 
game that you play where you swipe left if you don't like it, swipe right if you do, and you go through their inventory and they kind of send you earrings based on what you like. So uh, this is June's. Let me just uh, pop this open. And you get a little card in here that tells you about your earrings. I'll show you that in a minute. And then it comes in this little bubble thing, bright and pink. What else is in there? Sound like something else is in there. Nope. I was gonna say there shouldn't be. And the jewelry always comes in a cute little pink sachet. And you gotta open that. Uh, I keep these because I reuse these for different things. And then you get a little card that says that the earrings are worth uh, fifteen ninety nine. No, <laughs> just just no. They're not. Um, they're not got real anything on them so they're not worth that much um let me see this says to leave on allow to dry completely for around 20 to 30 minutes oh this one says i have to wipe it off i hate those uh, like why why would i want to wipe it off i'm not going to i don't feel like it says wipe off with a warm and since it's not sticking and it's you see how easy that was pretty much dry i'll go ahead and take it off but I'm just going to wipe my face with, with it because I can. <laughs> so, um, uh, someone's out there weed eating. I don't know why they'd weed eat right now. Like I said, it's a gajillion degrees outside. So, I'll go rinse my face off after this video. But, yeah, it says to wipe off the warm cloth. Anyway, um, so, yeah, these earrings are definitely not worth the price that they say they are. And it looks like I got an extra earring back in here. So that's cool. We can always use extra earring backs. And they come on this little foam thing. This month I have a little pair of studs here. And they are so super cute. I'm going to grab one here. Y'all ignore my nails. They're gross from messing with puppies and animals. And so they're kind of dirty. But y'all just ignore that. So there are these little black bunnies. Trimmed in gold with a little pearl tail. If you can see that look how cute those are so cute so I will definitely wear those little studs in my second hole so they are really adorable love those little black bunnies so that is this month's ear fleek um, that's really all I got for you guys uh, today or for right now um, I just wanted to tell you about my puppies <laughs> Hopefully I can get a little video of them. They're in there. It looks they're all calmed down right now. So some of them's drinking some milkies. The rest of them are asleep. I think they're not wiggling too much. And Mama's in there taking a snooze. I gave her a can of wet food to help her build back up her her weight and to help nurse. So I gave her a can of wet food earlier. So she's nice and full, and she's in there taking a nap. And it's nice and cool in here. So. Um, I'm going to take a quick little video of the babies for you, and like I said, if you want to see good pictures of them, just uh, go to my Facebook. The link is in the description for my Facebook, so you can go check them out. They are just precious. I also have a picture of them this morning in a puppy pile on my Instagram, so you can go check that out too. So that's really all I got for you. Um, I hope you enjoyed this short little mask Monday. I'm going to stay cool i think i'm gonna go eat some ice cream actually and watch game of thrones i just started game of thrones about three weeks ago i haven't seen any of it and i finally started to watch it and i love it so i'm gonna go watch some game of thrones eat some ice cream and just stay cool and enjoy the day so i hope you all enjoy the rest of your monday and i hope that you take time out to do something nice and relaxing for you whether it be a sheet mask a bubble bath a nice hot shower nice hot cup of coffee glass of wine if you prefer whatever you like go take time out and do that for yourself and uh, i will see you again real soon hopefully sooner than what I have been um like I said I've been a little bit busy but I'm I'm here uh doing good sore from crawling down on the floor with the puppies but you know it is what it is so I will see you guys really soon and take care and remember never miss a chance to sparkle bye sparklers okay hey, sparklers here's the cute little puppers some of them are feeding right now and some are sleeping and there's mama her snoozing right now her had a big bowl of food earlier, so her's taking a nappy and loving on her babies. <laughs>
Yeah, she's like, ugh, all these puppies. <laughs> but she's being a good mama. So there's the babies and there's mama. And they are wiggly and super cute and just adorable. So just wanted to show you them babies. See you later. Bye, sparklers. Thank you.